This lesson is going to be about um, how do you can find evidence from the texts. So you're able to make an informed opinion about a particular topic. And in this case, it's going to be about an event. So we're looking at the time of the Eureka of Rebellion. And so there were two sides to the story that we've been introduced to. So the first side is that we can think either the miners were right or the authorities were right. So these are the two opinions that we could stand with. At the moment, as you can see, there is a blank page because I'm not sure what my decision is going to be yet. So I'm going to be finding information and I'm going to be placing it under here and I'm going to decide which information is going to help me with my decision. All right, so first of all, I am going to go look at the text that we read another time. Um, the lead up to the Eureka stockade was a time of growing unrest on the gold fields. So we read this information before, so I don't need to read it to you again. Um, because I'm So I'm going to go have a look through it. And I'm just going to go back to my document here. And I'm going to find out, I'm going to choose the one um, looks for information first about the miners were right. So we're going to find out if any information on this um, text is going to be about the miners were right. So if I'm going to go down here, okay, um, it's talking about that it was a lot of money. And if you weren't lucky enough to find a lot of gold quickly and it didn't give the miners any guarantee that they could keep a mining, keep mining a particular piece of land. So the miners were right to rebel. This is according to this bit because it was a lot of money. So um, we're going to type it into our um, up here. So 30 shillings was a lot of money. You can't just say 30 shillings a month because that's what it was. A month, oops, a month was a lot of money. Okay, oops, next bit of information. Let's go and find out anything else that the miners were right. Okay, so the miners believed that the police and the officials were corrupt. So remembering, going back down here, we see that corrupt means dishonest. So we can, I'm actually going to use the word corrupt because that is a great tier two word that we should be using. So the miners believed that the police and the officials were corrupt. So, um, police, oh, um, believed the police and officials were corrupt. All right, um, police kept reading, okay, so that they would find, so that they, so the miners, I'll just add this to my bit of information there, that, um, that um, police sometimes sometimes or something sometimes kept um, the fines to themselves or kept fines for themselves for themselves all right what else have we got okay so we've said that oh and that they think that they weren't but the arrested Miners weren't given a fair trial. So the arrested miners um, and arrested miners weren't given a fair trial. Okay. Um, also, they said that they didn't have, they had a lack of rights. Okay. So they had a lack of rights. lack of rights they also elected leaders to speak to the governor but nothing changed oopsie sorry um, go away. so elected leaders to speak to the governor gov no, but nothing changed Okay, um, alright, so, 
they were right miners were right is this something about here so the manager was accused of his murder so a miner okay so a miner was killed so one of their comrades their friends was killed um, and the manager was accused of his murder but um, he was found not guilty so that's what they thought they decided that that um, was proof that the police were corrupt so one of their own was killed was killed but nothing but no one um, was charged proving to them that the police were corrupt. All right, going back in here, they gathered, they discussed, blah, blah, blah. So they were looking meetings and, okay, so they set fire. Well, that was a bit silly. Um, the crowd left the building. A small group of miners set fire and they were arrested by police. Oh, I don't think that's saying that the miners are right at all. All right, so now that all that information in that text. Now I'm going to go have a look at the other text that we had here. This is our, even though it's a story, it's remember a historical fiction that was based on truth. So um, that the miners were right. So where's the page? Looking at this page here, um, it's saying tonight Mama and the ladies are going to make a flag. It must be secret. It will be dangerous if they are called. So inferring from this story that we know is saying that that they are trying to protest and it's going to be dangerous and so knowing that what they're doing is wrong according to the police so they're saying it's not good um in there so we know that it wasn't the miners were right like the families it was affecting the families like that these we can say that because these families were staying up all night weren't they they're staying up all night um and many people were scared to use um to actually come and come and help make the flag the flag because it says where is it on here um that there's only two here it is only two of you so mama exclaims how will we manage so we have so we know that, that because there was only two of them, they thought it was dangerous. And then if we remember going back to the Lady Mrs. Falls or something like that, somewhere in here. Here we go. So husband wouldn't let us sew so the flag. So we know that it was dangerous. It wasn't good for their families. So that's adding more to that. Um, and going back down to the last page down to the last page wherever that is here we go so thousands of figures protest they can only so you can't tell anyway so it's the, um that they they made it they were strong so thousands of diggers have gathered to process so the protest so the miners are, are right again because there were thousands of diggers that was a lot of them it wasn't just three or four it was, it was lots of them. So let's go back to our document over here. So the miners were right because um, their whole families were being affected and thousands of diggers protested, not just a few, but many power of the people all right so now if we go back over here and we're going to find the evidence to say that the authorities were right so we'll go back to our first text here and I'm going to go back to the start and I'm saying that the authorities were right about um, this whole Eureka position here that the whole Eureka position that they were saying that there was a fast increase in population and that the government didn't have enough money or people to build the roads etc infrastructure and all the other services that we needed to help them function well so they raised the money 
so they could have the money to go towards building all this infrastructure. So the authorities were right in this re rebellion. The authorities were right in this rebellion because they um, they needed the money. So the government needed the money um, to help with building infrastructure to the cities and towns due to the population increase. They had to raise the funds in this way since the workers Workers were leaving in droves to find their fortune. All right, so go back to the text again. Okay, so the authorities were right. Um, okay, so police kept raiding the goldfields looking for miners to put in jail, to finally put in jail if they didn't have the license. So the authorities were right because they were just following the law. They were following the rules that were put in place. So they needed, they had to arrest and find people who weren't following the rules and that's their job. So um, police were following the rules to find and jail people who were breaking the law. Because the law was put in place for a reason. All right. Um, had, here people were right because okay here we go gathered they discussed the one appeal okay so the the authorities were right in here we're talking about the trying um the judge was trying to they wanted to ch uh, have the judge change their mind um his mind um and some of these people a small group of people set of the miners to be specific to set fire to the Rika hotel and were arrested by the police so those people they did the wrong thing so setting fire to a building is the wrong thing to do so the police arrested them Since the storybook was on the perspective of the miners, um, I don't have any information about the saying that the authorities were right because they were kind of talking about um, what, what they were doing. So I don't have any information there, but that's okay because I've got some information here saying that the authorities were right. So these are all my inf information from the text that I had that we can then um, form an opinion and that will be another video of how to write the opinion.